Welcome to the Vuzik podcast video number 12. We're going to take a quick look at how to use Extreme Sample Converter to convert sounds from Vuzik Station. You can visit extremetranslator.com to check the program out. I'm using the VST converter to sample the sounds. So I have load Vuzik Station already with the preset, multi presets, ultra aux, which has several layers and is very consuming on the CPU usage. So it's a very complex patch. What I'm doing, I select some layers to sample. You can select more, I'm just going to select a few here for this demonstration. So we don't take too much too long to sample and i have select seven seconds i select mono right so i i record a monos monophonic sound and i'm going to start sampling so i have finished sampling so i'm going to close my converter i can check the samples i have recorded What I'm going to do is use the auto loop option to auto loop all samples. So I have finished my auto looping. I'm going to export this to a SFZ file to a temporary folder. So I can open with SoundForge, another program I use. So here I can open with SoundForge my WAV files for the SFZ file. What I'm going to do is use, use crossfade loop. It's a nice loop feature. And I'm also going to double click here at the end to remove with my delete key. And I'm going to remove all this excess from the audio. And I'm also going to do a quick fading at the start so it doesn't click when I press play. <laughs> So I'm going to do the same thing for, for the other samples. Just a quick, quick work. And then I have all my samples ready for playing. Let me bypass this. So now I'm going to run Orion Platinum so I can select Vuzik Station. And inside the Vuzik Station I have loaded my test SFZ file which has the layers I, I have sampled. So I can do some pretty complex patches here with the sounds alone without using too much CPU usage. So there we go, you can do some very good sampling jobs with Extreme Sample Converter. That's it for this video, I hope you appreciate it, thank you.